Hello and welcome to the Breathing Dreams channel. I'm Brittany and today's video is all about my five month old puppy Luna Fay. It's going to be an exciting day because this is Luna's first ever flight and family vacation. We're taking her to sunny Key West, Florida. It's definitely going to be an adventure for us too because we have to pack for all of Luna's needs while away. She woke up ready to go with her normal endless amounts of energy. She has no idea what amazing journey awaits her, but she seems curious as we prepare for the day ahead. We'll take all the necessary items to ensure Luna's comfort and safety during the journey. We pack our crate with the needed necessities, including food, water bowl, treats, chew toys, shot records, and t-shirts with our scent on it. Today we're flying Allegiant Airlines, which allows pets in the cabin for a $50 fee per way, which is much more reasonable than most airlines. When arriving at the airport, we have to check in at the Allegiant desk to ensure that Luna's carrier meets the appropriate size requirements. Luna was a little afraid during security and waiting for the flight is a total test of patience on both of our parts. With some positive reinforcement and some treats, we keep her calm and entertained in her carrier. Now for the moment we've been anxiously waiting for, Luna's first time on an airplane. Luna will spend the flight in her own little space under the seat in front of us. We fly a lot, so it's very important this goes well so Luna can join us on future adventures. Her carrier is safely stowed and she's cozy and secure in her spot. The sounds and sensations to take off are new to Luna, but she is surprisingly calm and relaxed in her little carrier. I place a t-shirt with my scent on it on top of her carrier to add an extra layer of comfort during the flight. Throughout the flight, we check on Luna occasionally, offering treats for being such a good puppy. She quickly acclimates to the flight experience though, and we find her sleeping through much of the flight. As we descend, Luna's calm, relaxed, and sleepy in her carrier. For a first time flyer, she's done an exceptional job, don't you think? Have you flown with your dog? What was your experience like? Please leave your tips for flying with your dog below. We're finally here in Key West, and even though all the morning's activities were new experiences for Luna, she's handled them like a champ. She's calm in her crate as we get our luggage. We take an Uber from the airport to our hotel and keep Luna in her carrier. She's getting a little anxious, but she remains quiet. There it is, Luna's first steps in Key West. Her journey from Home to here has been full of firsts for our little Lou, but there's still so much to come. I can't wait to start exploring Key West with her. Key West is incredibly pet friendly. It's a paradise for both humans and their furry friends. It is pet friendly beaches, parks, cafes, restaurants, and it's the perfect place for Luna to explore and enjoy a new city. Our first pet friendly activity is the Key West Aquarium. Luna is fascinated with all the fish swimming in the tanks. She even gets to see them feed the sharks. Good thing she's not on the menu. We enjoy moving around the island on the scooter that we rented. Luna loves the breeze passing through her carrier as we speed down the highway. Later in the day, she makes friends with many of the feathered residents of the island and takes in all the new scents that surround her. Most of the restaurants in Key West are pet friendly. We bring Lou with us to meals and she patiently waits under the table or in her carrier during our meals. She enjoys the attention and pets she gets from friendly staff and fellow diners. For dinner, she received a special treat of some frozen chicken broth in the shape of a dog bone for being such a good girl. 
there's no better way to end our day in Key West than with a Key West sunset. It's been a day full of unforgettable moments and I'm glad it's documented for the years to come. Thanks for joining us on our first trip to Key West with Luna. We hope to see you back here soon. Bye.